你好，你好吗？我叫德莱德。The last time we talked about numbers, but before hitting on Chinese, we must know about something and put it in our consideration. This something is called the stroke order. All right, what does this thing mean? Okay, we knew that the word you means near, near, and this V here because we go down with the sound and then rise it higher once more, near, near, so it has this shape. So the sound goes this way. And ni means you. Okay. And we said also that you in Chinese written like this. So this shape is called you in Chinese. And the stroke order is the rule that helps you to write the Chinese calligraphy. So, if I write ni in this way, it's wrong. And if I write it this way, also it's wrong. And the original ni looks like this. So, why is this right and why are those both wrong? Well, they look identical to some extent. Well, here the stroke order is the thing that says what I've written is right or wrong, and we will see how. So, first, we must know the meaning of the stroke. When I put my pen on the paper or on the board and draw a line, release my pen, that is called a stroke. Another stroke is like this, another one, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, and seventh. So, this is called the stroke, and the stroke order is the that I draw this. First, then this, and this is the third one, this is the fourth, the fifth, sixth, and seventh. This is the arrangement in which we must draw the word ni in Chinese. Well, what if I drew this like what I have done? We have noticed that I didn't release my pen, so it's considered a stroke. So if I count the number of strokes of this word, I've had this one, two, three, four, and five. So there are only five strokes, while the original ni contains seven strokes. In this one, I mistake in the arrangement of the strokes in the word, so I drew this first, then this, this, and this. So this is wrong, because I didn't arrange the strokes in the right way. And the last one is like this one, is drew correctly. So what's the importance of the stroke order? Why it's very important in Chinese to know the stroke order in order to draw 
a Chinese word. Actually, a stock order is very important in Chinese because it's used in dictionaries. It's used in dictionaries. If you want to look up a word in Chinese, you must know the stroke order because you search for the word by its stroke order, not by the pronunciation. So if you want to search for the word ni, you search for the part which contains the word with seven strokes and then search for the other parts of your word that you are searching for. But this thing is not important in the English or the French or the Deutsch. I can say, I can write Mandarin this way. And it's right. Some people may write the A like this. May write the M like this. And it's working. And it doesn't affect the word or the meaning of the word. But here in Chinese it's very important to know the stroke order. So, in the next times, we will learn three things in the Chinese lessons. We will learn the pronunciation of the words. We will learn the meaning of each word. And at last, and the very important thing, is how to write the word with the right stroke order and that's it for today and see you next time thanks for watching